Hello everybody, welcome back to Tom Reads Things. My name is Tom. I hope you're all very well. We are very excited today because we are off to Norfolk for a week. So um, we're taking the dogs with us, a little holiday with the dogs. So yeah, um, we're taking lots of books to read. Are we going on holiday? Are we going on holiday? Do you want to go in the car and go on holiday? In the car. There we go. Before we go, let's just have a look at these lovely bloody hanging baskets. What a wonder they are. As you go into Norfolk, there's lovely woodlands. Very pretty. Really quite pretty. Oh, that's lovely. Hello, Mother! Say hello. Oh, hiya. Oh, hiya. Down by the beach with the babies. Come on then, Harry. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Just walking back from Sheringham to where we're staying through this, what can only be really described as some kind of jungle. So we have had a lovely afternoon walking around Sheringham and I have now decided that I am going to start reading Murmur by Will Eaves. So let's get to it, shall we? So it's the end of our first day here in Norfolk. I've got a very sleepy Labrador asleep on me. Um, I am reading, uh, I'm still reading Murmur by Will Eaves. Um, it's a bit slow going for me. There's not really much happening and if there is, I'm not really getting it. Um, but I will persevere with it. It's only 175 pages long, so very, very short. Um, so hoping that I can finish this in the next day or two because I've brought some other brilliant books with me uh, to read while I am here. So yes, um, I will check in with you tomorrow. Morning everyone, it is a gorgeous day here in Norfolk. So we are going to take the dogs down to the beach and then come back, have some breakfast and crack on with some more reading. Boy, Harry. Where's that ball then? Good boy. <laughs> you like the sea? Do you like the sea? Hey, go on then. Go and play. <laughs> Come on in, Harry. Soon be time to go back and start some reading. So I am still reading Murmur by Will Eaves. Um, it's getting a bit better, but I'm not fully enjoying it. I'll talk more about this in my wrap up at the end of the month. But for now, I think we are going to head into Sheringham with the dogs and see if we can get some vegan street food, which we saw yesterday. So really looking forward to that. Yum! I'm out to Sheringham to get some grub. It's so nice around here. Oh, well made. Found somewhere to eat. The dogs are happy. Hello, baby. So, I, while we're waiting for our food to arrive, I had a quick Google for bookshops. And I found one very close, so I'm going to go and have a look. So, whilst it was a lovely bookshop full of lots of old books, um, 
they didn't take card, so, uh, and I have no cash on me, so I'm going back to get my lunch. So I finally finished Murmur by Will Eaves. Really wasn't that much of a fan. Um, if you can hear panting in the background, that's Harry. Um, I'm now reading uh, The Standing Chandelier, not that you can tell because I've taken the dust jacket off, by Lionel Shriver. Um, I'm 10 pages into this and uh, we will see how it goes. I'm going to read this uh, for the rest of the evening and I will see you tomorrow. Morning, everybody. We are. Oh, she had a pretty proud of that. We are going to Cromer this morning, um, taking the dogs. Mark's here, taking the dogs um, to I walk. So. Oh, yeah, he's driving. Um, taking the marks, taking the marks to walk along the beach. Taking the dogs to walk along the beach. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Um, and we're going to hopefully get a spot of breakfast, and then spend the morning in Cromer, and then come back for a chilled day of more reading. Yeah. Mark's reading Anne Frank, what is it? The Definitive Edition. The Definitive Edition, the diet of the diary of Anne Frank, which includes all of the bits that were removed um, in, before its first publication, so that's quite good. Um, so yeah, come to Cromer with us, bye! Here we are. There's people out on boats. Oh yeah, because it's the sea. They are absolutely gagging to get down to the beach. They are obsessed. Harry's like pulling like nobody's business. Where's your ball then? Good boy. You all right, Sally? Mate? You're full of it, aren't you? I can't give you your ball back because you keep dropping it in the sea and you're going to lose it, mate. No, come on. Come on in. Good boy. Go and explore. She could not care less that he's having the time of his life. Good boy. God, I love him so much. <laughs> so we are, we've finished on the beach, haven't we? With the doggies. And now we are just going to have some breakfast. Look at that face. Literally an angel. Sorry, I can't bear it. Quaffy. Very hungry. So there is a lovely bookshop here. Bookworms of Chroma. But it doesn't open for another 10 minutes. Very frustrating. So it's quarter past 10, way past my bedtime. Um, I haven't filmed much today. Um, we went into uh, Chroma and we had a lovely walk along the beach. And then we went and had some breakfast, but Harry decided it would be a great idea to drink a load of seawater, um, which is very dangerous for dogs. So he didn't drink a lot of it, to be fair. We kept a, an eye on him. And as soon as we realised he was doing it, we stopped him from doing it. But he has, he was, he wasn't very well earlier. And, but we, so we've just been keeping an eye on him today. Um, so that's my eventful day done. But I did finish The Standing Chandelier by Lionel Shriver. Um, I think thought it was okay it was all right um i think that uh the characters really annoyed me and i felt it was a bit um full of itself uh and i've actually since learned some stuff about lionel shriver that i'm not very pleased to hear so that's kind of tainted the book for me as well um i definitely won't be reading anything by her ever again um so yes, I've now just started, let me put it for you here, I've now just started, again I've taken the dust jacket off so you can't see it, um, but it's uh, On Earth We're Briefly Gorgeous by Ocean Vong, so I've read the first kind of 20 pages of this and already know it's going to be a brilliant, brilliant, brilliant read, so really looking forward to that, um, so I will catch up with you tomorrow. The rain has cleared up, so we're taking a walk into Sheringham. There is, with the dogs, I have, there is a discount book and jigsaw shop in Sheringham I've seen online. Oh. So I wouldn't mind going to have a look in there. Oh, Harry's having a poo. It's so pretty, these little nature trails. 
you can go on around here. Do you want to go to the beach, Harry? Mm, maybe not. After yesterday's ocean drinking situation that we had. All these lovely wild flowers. Yes, Harry, you would be allowed to go on the beach, but apart from the fact that you decided to eat, drink ocean water yesterday, I have to be very careful of you now. Come on, mister. No, I'm sorry, Kath, I would absolutely love one of these little shelters here. So Mark is sitting down with a coffee and I am determined to find some books on this holiday, so I'm going to a discount bookshop. Let's hope they've got something I want. So that was another complete waste of time. They basically didn't have anything that I wanted. <laughs> I've got loads of books that I want to read anyway back at the place that we're staying at, so that's fine. It's got a very large face, hasn't it? <laughs> Huge face. We're on our way back. Very disappointed that I couldn't get any books. I don't know if you can see, but there's so many butterflies in this kind of wild flower field. So nice. They're actually bees. Oh. So it is the end of, where are we? The end of Thursday. Um, we've decided to stay an extra day. So instead of going home tomorrow, we're going home on Saturday. So we had a lovely walk along the beach in Sheringham today. Um, went down to the sea. I'll insert a picture um, of me at the beach here. And also a picture of Mark at the beach here. Um, and yes, so Sally's barking. She's wondering who I'm talking to. So yeah, I'm, re I'm still reading um, On Earth We're Briefly Gorgeous by Ocean Bong and I'm loving it. So looking forward to reading that more tomorrow and hopefully finishing it. Morning. So we are still not sure whether we're going to be coming home today or tomorrow, but we've decided to come for a walk in the woods opposite where we're staying and um, we'll decide when we get back. As always, these two are having a lovely time. Come on then. What are you doing? Want me to kick your ball? There's one thing these idiots love. It's a woodland hawk. What are you like, mister? Can you wear yourself out with that ball? Come on, mister. So we've decided to head home. Um, it's not great weather in Norfolk for the next couple of days, so we thought we would head home. But we've been off for a week and we've still got a week off, so we're going to be doing a lot more reading over this coming week and really looking forward to getting into some new books. Um, we're, all, we're also going to be doing some other bits and pieces around the house, some DIY, and also hopefully some visits to some stately homes, which we will take you along with us. So uh, yes, um, thanks for joining us and see you next time.